the U.S. Pentagon, where national security is built on secrets, intelligence on adversaries and allies. This leak of sensitive documents, published on social media, covers both. As the U.S. Defense Secretary met Ukraine's Prime Minister at the Pentagon, questions went unanswered. Thank you, Mr. Secretary, are you concerned that the document leak wasn't on Ukraine no questions. On the Thank you, press. This can't have been their easiest meeting. Because the leaked documents detail U.S. training and equipment schedules to support Ukraine in its war with Russia. There was intelligence on Ukraine's President Vladimir Zelensky and talk of Ukraine's battle for the Donbass region likely heading for a stalemate throughout 2023. Another document revealed conversations between South Korean officials about their reluctance around a U.S. request for ammunition to be sent to Ukraine. There's a lot of ability to digitally track back. Bradley Moss is a national security lawyer based in Washington. The Pentagon investigation into who leaked what is something he's seen before. If they can figure out the original source documents, they can then, you know, sort of work backwards to track who had access to it and who were some of the last people to try to extract that off classified servers. Following the leak, the Pentagon spoke of a very serious risk to national security. But it's also urged caution with regard to the documents, stating that slides appear to have been doctored. Similarly, the UK's Ministry of Defence says the documents shouldn't be taken at face value. Eh, Ukraine's Defence Minister said the leaked documents contain what he called truths and not truths. I call it a special informational psychological operation done on purpose. The beneficiary of this operation is, of course, Russia. The purpose of this operation is to lower the level of trust between partners, the United States of America, first of all, and other countries. Whatever its impact on trust between the United States and its allies, the Pentagon leak can't improve confidence. 